Copper has natural antimicrobial properties, which means it has the ability to kill or inhibit the growth of bacteria. The exact mechanism of how copper kills bacteria is not fully understood, but there are several proposed theories. Disruption of cell membrane. Copper ions have a strong affinity for binding to the bacterial cell membrane. It is believed that copper ions can disrupt the integrity of the cell membrane, causing leakage of essential nutrients and ions, and ultimately leading to the death of the bacteria. Generation of reactive oxygen species, ROS, copper ions can participate in redox reactions, leading to the generation of reactive oxygen species, ROS, such as hydroxyl radicals. ROS are highly reactive molecules that can cause damage to bacterial cells by oxidizing various components including proteins, lipids, and DNA. This oxidative stress can be detrimental to bacterial survival. DNA damage. Copper ions can interact with the DNA of bacteria, causing damage to the genetic material. This interference with DNA replication and repair processes can disrupt bacterial growth and lead to cell death. Disruption of enzyme function. Copper ions can also interfere with the function of essential enzymes within bacterial cells. Many enzymes rely on on specific metal ions for their activity, and copper ions can disrupt these processes, leading to dysfunction and ultimately cell death. It's important to note that the antimicrobial properties of copper have been extensively studied and validated. Copper surfaces, such as doorknobs, countertops, and medical equipment, have been shown to reduce bacterial contamination and the spread of infections in healthcare settings. This has led to the increased use of copper-based materials in various applications to help prevent the transmission of harmful bacteria.